Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard earned money on Madden packs? Look no further than my sponsor, MMO EXP, for the cheapest and most reliable muck coins on the market. And don't forget to use code FURDY at checkout for 5% off. What's going on, guys? Today we are looking at the brand new Dante Culpepper. Of course, before we get started, if you are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. 62% of you guys who watch the videos are actually not subscribed, so most likely that's you right now. And we'll be live tonight on Twitch, probably around 8 30, 9 p.m. Eastern Time tonight, live on Twitch. I better see you there. But Dante Culpepper, is this card the best QB in the game? Definitely not. I think it's a definite no. Um, I think he probably will still end up falling behind someone like Will Levis would be my prediction. I think that's pretty much his max rating, ranking to me. Um, but, you know, the stats are good. It's Dante Culpepper, good accuracy stats, 6'4", 260. And as far as a being a ball carrier goes, he's got 97 trucking. You really shouldn't be trucking with your quarterback. If you don't have like trust or something like that, like you really should not be doing something like that. It's just not smart. It's stupid to do. But 99 throw under pressure with my strat card, good build. You know, it, but, you know, it's okay. And as far as the release goes, he does get the Big Ben Eli Manning release. That's gonna be a Slinger Five, which, in my opinion, is gonna need Gunslinger. You're definitely gonna need to use Gunslinger on Cole Pepper. So here's my ability setup on Cole Pepper, and here's my thoughts behind it. So. The first thing is tactician tactician is three abilities in one it's conductor it's playmaker it's hot route master all in one ability so you got to use this one because the value is just too good you then need a velocity boosting ability on the card so instead of you paying five ap for set feet lead or even six ap for pass lead you got to go with pass lead for two so to me you need both these abilities but because his release is kind of mid you need gunslinger so that's going to put you at another two ap and then gift wrap because when i don't have gift wrap i feel like i needed gift wrap and then i just kind of spiral but I always run gift wrap, so 6 AP setup on Culpepper, and of course the X-Factors literally do not matter at all because they'll never turn on. And he doesn't get anything special, by the way, at all. N nothing special, okay? There you go. But let's see what Culpepper can do. Of course, by the way, a bunch of very popular theme teams for him. Lions, Vikings, Dolphins, and of course the Raiders. But, you know, Bo will be better, Vic will be better, Peyton will probably be better. I mean, there'll be a lot of guys that'll be better. I'm obviously missing something off the top of my head right now, but... We'll see how this card plays. Should be a fun one. All right, here we go. We're marching out. Dante Culpepper for his first snap of the day. And it's only right that we get him started on the ground. I feel like it's only right. And by the way, with, with me running like 6 AP on Culpep, we lose some route techs on this team. Um, like, like, with, like kind of with my team build now, we lose route techs instead of that amazing, you know, Mike Vick build. And that, should, that, should, that right there, we should have pitched. That would have been a big game if we pitched that. But obviously, I'm selfish and I want Culpep to do everything in this gameplay. So... We're not going to pitch that. But let's try going motion spot here. Looks like he's playing man, zero blitz. If we get zone looks, though, which I don't feel like we... It actually does kind of feel like zone, maybe. Let's streak this. But also, this could be that A-gap stuff. This could be that as well. It's definitely not. We're going to we're gonna have our man Darius Hayward Bay on the sideline. Darius Hayward Bay turns the corner. We have Jukebox. Oh, And you see that release. It really does wind up. I mean, I used Big Ben over... I think it was on Thursday night I used Big Ben for a little bit on stream. And, uh, yeah, we were feeling every single hitch in that release for sure. Oh, I'm on conservative. That's why I can't juke. Wow, dude. You, you, you know, you put it on conservative and you forgot you did that. And then you looked like an 88. Because, yeah, that makes sense. No, 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 no that was nice. That was nice. Good work. All right, we're going to... He's got... I might just keep this with Culpep and see what, see what happens, honestly. Oh, my God. I thought I could... I, I thought I... I, I, uh, that, I, I, I All right, shovel option again here with Culpep. Here we go. Pitch it. There we go. Cole Pep. There we go. Beautiful work. Oh, I, I didn't have Jukebox again. Somehow that worked. Somehow that worked. I, I literally rely on Jukebox so much. You guys see it right now. That's what he's going to do. And again, like he's got good trucking, but you should never be trucking. It's fine for me, Cole Pep. So I'll push him over. He, my, my man's 260. Cole Pep's 260, bro. He's 260. Let's get busy. Let's get busy. Someone push him in. Push him in. Okay, this should be fine. Unless he gets over onto Sean Taylor and user Sean Taylor stock slants okay here we go eyeball good ball okay we got it there maybe I had someone else open we hit one corner out already we're gonna this is definitely man-to-man -man coverage so we don't even unless there's a zone over the top we may have to pull something but something like this we that he's on Isaiah Simmons or not Isaiah Simmons head that quick over the middle there we go Bojack nice check down first down and again, this is why, like, you need Gunslinger. With Gunslinger, Culpepper can play. 
You know what I mean? He's a card you can buy. It. Oh, I didn't even. I didn't, you know what I didn't even mention? I didn't even mention this dude's price tag. He's a one point what mil right now? One point four mil while recording this. So is Dante Culpepper worth one point four mil? Absolutely not. Mike Vick is so much cheaper. Bo Jackson is a hundred thousand coins. So yeah, unless you just want, like have a Culpepper team and just really want to use the man. It genuinely makes no sense to you like the it's what sucks. I, I don't know. These ultimate legend cards to me this year have been very underwhelming. They're not even close to up to par with like AKA cards and cards like that, in my opinion. I got, another, I got, another, I got another check down here. But to me, they're not even close. Um, I mean they, they give like the occasional like Randy Moss, they'll give him Moss, they'll give Dion pre-baked return man. They'll do things like that every once in a while, but when when they don't do that, these cards end up being very average and will get dated quite soon. Uh, and I think no one's really debating that. It'll probably happen. Here we go. What we want is see if Dion will sit out there. He kind of does. We're gonna have that open again. It's been it's been cooking all day. I want to save for the post, but when I see when I see that getting when I see that leverage and I see his users nowhere to be found, that was DB fire too though. Okay, we do have to score before we get too close to the red zone because I don't want to get stuck trying to pass or run triple option in the red zone again. Right, I'm gonna go post again here. I'm going post again here. Here we go. Here we go. Can someone cook for me? Someone cook for me. Someone cook for me. Someone cook for me. Kelsey Loki cooked. No, I'm Raz when that cook. We get a don't get it under pressure and accurate. It's a touchdown. Finally, I hit one of my posts. Finally, I hit one of my posts. No route tech was even necessary. It was covered two man. So the once you spread the middle there and that underneath coverage is not there to shade it, it gets pretty easy to throw something like that. But we got we gotta go triple option, right? Triple option. I'm gonna take it all conservative real quick and just try to run through someone's throat no pause with cold pepper we well we got 95 trucking something like that cold pepper should be the guy to do this right here with the middle cold pepper. bang bang oh, okay. that's why that's why you don't truck with a qb that doesn't have trust i don't care what the trucking rating says you can't truck with a qb you can't do it you can't do it okay they should drop a power back qb that would be fire the marco murray is pretty solid but Bo will still that, that's a crazy look Bo will still be better Dickerson will still be better. I think he's honestly pretty good, though. As far as, like, the non-X Factor running backs, he's one of the best in the game. I don't think anyone's going to debate me on that. I mean, that looks pretty... He looks pretty good. Got a gap in me. Oh, we, get, we do get open right there. Dalton Schultz does not get much play, but he does now. There we go. Dalton Schultz getting open. Timeout. Should have went out of bounds. All right. Post is a man coverage destroyer. It is a man coverage devastator. When in doubt, you run post and let it cook. Quick snap it. He's not even ready for it. He, he's in zone, but we're still gonna try getting this underneath throw. We do get that beautifully. I'm gonna Rostos his jukebox. I'm gonna turn to corner. But someone else is gonna pick him up though for sure. There we go. Timeout. We are on the eight yard line with Dante Culpepper, and we are not. Oh, should we try a read option? I really want to. I really want to punch in this shovel option to be honest. I really want to punch in the shovel option. I feel like it's probably our best chance to to, to try to truck somebody. We have one timeout, so we, we're able to try this at least one one more time, or even pitch it maybe, or do a full cutback on it. Truck, truck. Okay, I should have went left. Oh, time out. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I think I can motion people around. Let's like, let's like do like a weird like motion. Maybe he'll be thinking like, oh, it's not that play anymore. He's gonna pass it. Oh, let let's do some fake audibles or something like that. Make him think, oh yeah, yeah. No, he's better throw a crazy deep bomb here. Nope. Fight. There we go. Beautiful. I still got it a little bit. I mean, I want to finish it. I want to finish that with cold pepper. But sometimes when the reads are that obvious, he's got to fl fl flick the triple option and just get in the end zone, bro. But I think on conservative, Culpep's definitely formidable for that. He's a big body. He he's falling a little bit. You know what I mean? Like, on conservative, you're not going to be able to utilize his trucking or anything like that. But on conservative, I mean, he's cool. He he's cool. He he'll get the job done for you. But he's not Vic. You know what I mean? I that's why I think that's why I think Vic is above any other QB in the game because not only does he have elite passing AP and abilities, he also has evasive and the ability for tries or if you want to go run and gun if you run the ball less it's up, really up to you it's genuinely crazy i'm gonna oh we got, we got a truck truck stick cold pepper who was it antonio camardi i think on your back buddy get on your back okay pause jesus okay beautiful work fellas we do convert on the onside kick and that will always bring a smile to my face whenever that happens i really should consider onside kicking more like i think the onside kick not, not that i think it i know it is one of the um it, it just works like i, I think it it's probably the best it's ever been. And I want to try this play right here. Don't know why I want to try this, but to be honest, but I want to see what, 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 what will happen if we do something like this. Low-key, not bad. Low-key, not a bad RPO. 
throw a let's just get back in post and someone will get open the problem is like i'm playing a man-to-man -man guy right now and we lose all our route tags because i have cold pepper it's very unfortunate timing of what's going on right now let's just put him on a zig or something no i don't like a zig actually i don't hate a zig let's try this i don't know we'll see zig cook zig did not cook he that cooked though and cold pep under pressure there's an absolute dime i want to do a super oh 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 okay we're, and we're close to the red zone again zig corner out yeti do i trust travis here oh oh my no one guarded him okay well that's gonna do for today's gameplay dante culpepper is the man worth it hell no dante culpepper where does he end up where does dante culpepper end up to me as a as a as a qb in this game right now who would i take over the guy i'm taking Vic over him I think he's pretty close to Patrick Mahomes. I think Patty actually might be better, which I, I think about that. This card is pretty like I'm taking Kirk, but then I would probably go. Hmm. I would go Levis. I'd obviously. Damn. There's definitely some interesting names here. I don't know. Drop a comment down below. What do y'all think about Dante Culpepper, man? Me personally, I think I'm pretty mid on the card. And for that price, He's definitely not worth it. Do not buy him. And of course, as always, thank you for watching today's video. And I will see you boys in the next one.